Okay, our daughter Andrea had a store on Market Square, 27 Market Square. She bought the building and had it renovated and she opened up Vagabondia. And Vagabondia is one of the books that Frances Burnett wrote before she became Frances Burnett when she was Frances Hopkins. And um, so Andy always loved the secret garden and Jim was a good friend and Jim was starting the secret garden at Knoxville Botanical Gardens. And we grew up in East Knoxville and we wanted to do something in memory of honor, in memory of Andrea, in honor of Frances Burnett. And that's all I gotta say. Yeah. Of course, the East Knoxville connection is like one block down is Houston. It was Houston Presbyterian Church, where I went to church as a kid from the time I was eight or nine years old till I got out of high school. So this was that time the Howl Nursery, we used to come up here with my father to buy stuff. I mean, in particular, he would, buy, he would buy sphagnum moss here. It was the only place in town you could get it. So just get, uh, East Knoxville, doing something in East Knoxville. You know, this is our home. This is a, where, we, where we grew up, went to school and all of that. And of course, Andy called this to our attention, as Jane said. And, uh, uh, and Andy started coming out here. And she'd mentioned it in sort of a casual way before she came ill because she liked a garden. And then she and Jim had made connections downtown when Jim was associated with the mass stores. And uh, we, uh, uh, and then Andy's husband remi uh, sort of kept us, reminded us of the fact that uh, she was working out here on, she's gardening out here. In particular, she, this idea of the secret garden. 